Good morning, Miva. Here it is. Uh, we're on Monday morning. It's the last day of September, so you know what's up next, the spooky and colorful month. So hopefully you all had a great weekend and things are going well for you today. We just have a quick few few words to say here this morning before you get into your advisory period activities, which are always great. So uh, let's begin with our quote of the day, and the truth is, and this one I had to think about a bit, and maybe you should too. The truth is, not saying thank you does more damage than actually thank you does good. Hmm. Give that a little thought today as you go about your day. The word thank you is two words, right? It's a great phrase to use. Um, but not saying it can do something, too. That's interesting. Okay. Up next is Today in History, September 30th. Here we are. So in 1846, the first anesthetized tooth extraction is performed by a Dr. William Morton in Charleston, Massachusetts. I thought that might be interesting for those of you that love going to the dentist. You all do, right? Because you are supposed to do that every six months at least to get your teeth checked. All right. So good, good little warning for you there. But boy, it's been around for a while. 1846. 1954, the first atomic-powered submarine, the Nautilus, is commissioned in Groton, in Connecticut. And so that's kind of an interesting thing because now we all have, uh, most of the world has nuclear-powered submarines and other ships uh, of, of the sort. So that was quite a, a novel thing back then. And then in 1927, I thought it was interesting, Babe Ruth hits his 60th home run of the season off Tom Zachary in Yankee Stadium, New York City. And of course, the Babe was known uh, for his uh, home run hitting abilities, and so he he carried that home. Uh, his the total for a long time. He was the the big until uh, until uh, Hank Aaron broke his 714 mark some years ago. All right, so that's our day in history. So here we are again at the announcements. All right, there's one new announcement that I'd like to talk to you about. So those of you thinking about teaching as a career, the Future Teachers Academy is happening. It's a free event in high school for high school students interested in exploring the field of education. So Future Teachers Academy, an event for students who are interested in exploring the field of education, is being hosted by Thomas College and will be held on November 8th from 8.30 to 1.30 on their campus at 180 West River Road in Waterville. During the event, students will be able to participate in a day-long hands-on and experimental teaching environment led by professional faculty from Thomas College School of Education, as well as partners from the Department of Education and Maine Teachers of the Year. So that is on November 8th. It's from 8 to 1.30. It's Thomas College. It is not a field trip for us, but it's something we thought you might be interested in in case you uh, have the time and, and the inclination. We are always looking for good new teachers, all right? So make sure that you think about that as a career as you go forward in your, in your, in your schooling, okay? So you can register using the little uh, thing here or just call them uh, at that number, 859-1111. Okay. Our upcoming events haven't changed much. We do have the open house, though, that's coming right up this week. Um, that'll be Thursday, 4.30 to 6, here at MIVA in the Ballard Center, right in Augusta. And so you're welcome to come to that and have some fun. We also have been pushing the Pumpkin Fest, which I, I saw in the chat last week. A lot of you are planning to attend, which is a, that's a great event. And, of course, there's Main Earth Science Day that's coming up soon. So make sure that you have those on your calendar and ready to go when when they come up all right so now it's going to be time to go to your advisor breakouts and go oh well, actually you're already in your advisor breakouts but let's get to work that's the the deal of the day and the, the work today is uh, i hope anyway a little bit more fun for you as your teachers can delve into some more topics all right so that's it for today make it a great day everyone and we'll catch you on the downside <music>